Welcome back, Pixelov21 here, and today I'll be showing you how to not only install a virtual box, but also how to install CK2 generator on a Mac. As you can see, this is the Mac OS that I am using, and let's get right into it. So first thing you have to do is go to new, and you're gonna just give it a name. Let's go with CK2 gen. And now, depending on the on the ISO file you download, you pick it from here. Well, I downloaded the Windows 864 bit one, 8.164 bit, and I'll show you the download directory. It will be a link in the description where to get that from. And remember, all Macs come with VirtualBox installed, and if you don't have it already, I'll show you where it is in case your version is so old that it didn't come with VirtualBox. So now here, this is the way you allocate how much RAM that you have. And now if you're having any issues with that, let's say your stuff isn't running fast enough, this is most likely where the problem comes from, as you have to divide the RAM between the two of them. And this is two, and the general rule of thumb is you go with about half. Half is normally enough to get what you need done. So here, I already have one installed before, but if you're creating a new one, you see I create a virtual hard disk now, and then you go to create, and now you choose VDI, image you don't choose any other one this is the one that you need so you go to dynamically allocate size because if you do fix size you find out that you run out of space quicker than you planned so dynamically allocated is the right one to do and then here this is where you, the initial amount of space you have but as you carry on the space will grow larger you go to create so yeah then when you open it to run it initially it's gonna ask you gonna ask you where this stuff is located now I have mine saved in my downloads it's already right there in my downloads so once you have that you can just say start but since I already have one installed I'm not gonna I'm not gonna do that because that takes time so if I go to the one that I already have installed which is this I can start this one and I can show you how it works So as you can see, I have a perfectly running Windows installed on my PC. So, yeah. So I already have Crusader Kings 2 installed and I already have Steam installed. And any uh, other thing that you're gonna need is you're gonna need to have your your um your .NET framework already installed. So this is all the stuff that you need. So first off, you're gonna have to enter your CK2 generator 0 0.95. So that's the. Then you run this. So when you're in here, you have to go to your game install directory. And now if you're using uh, Mac, if you're using it, it's going to be in here. If you scroll down, it will be in. It will be in your uh, this PC local disk program files 86. Steam, Steam apps, and since mine mine is is saying coming here, but it's already downloaded for some reason it keeps there. So you just pick here, you say OK, and that is that is the directory. And then you just say load map, and then there you go. Your CK2 generator is being run. So thank you for watching. Remember to leave a like, maybe comment, subscribe, check out my other videos, and. Thank you for watching.